finally arrived. Please come a step closer and give a warm welcome again to our cast mastery lead, Craig Johnston. Thank you very much. I mean, what, what a night we've had so far this evening, seeing some incredible engineering next door, courtesy of Bentley. And we're very, very pleased to show you, for the first time in the flesh, um, some incredible engineering in terms of bottle design from the partnership between Bentley and the Macallan. Some of you, who's, who's had Macallan before? Let's find out that. Put your hands up if you've had Macallan before. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. A few people smiling as well, so we obviously enjoyed it. Um, this, you may or may not know, is our 200th anniversary. So the distillery started making whiskey in 1824. Um, we, we, we thought this would be the perfect year to showcase the craftsmanship of our past, as well as our, our push for perfection in the future. And what better way to do that than to work with some of the, the greatest minds in automotive design and ask them to come up with a vessel for some of the most precious single malt Scotch whisky in the world. So with Horizon, there are only 700 bottles. There is only one in mainland Europe. And you may notice that it's half full. Half full, not half empty. I like to be positive. <laughs> the reason for that is we didn't want to just unveil this. We wanted to let you try this whiskey this evening. So we do have it in glasses, which will be coming around shortly, see it has them. And I get the privilege of coming in from a very cold and snowy Scotland to talk you through one of the most precious Macallans that we will release in our 200th anniversary. So I guess the first question I have for the room is have any of you ever professionally approached a whiskey before? Yeah. A couple of people, yep, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> What I want to do with you this evening is maybe share um, the, the five-step program of enjoying a good glass of Scotch whisky while we look at this, and then you can take the remainder of the, the, the dram back to your table um, and enjoy it with, with dinner. So we like to say in the, the blending lab that there are five things to look for in a good glass of Scotch whisky. The first one is the colour. So if you hold it up to the light and have a look through it, it's 100% natural colour with the Macallan. When we're putting our whiskies, when we're vatting and blending our whiskies together, we are blending as much for colour as we are for flavour. And our master whisky maker, Christine Campbell, has selected six casks from throughout the Macallan warehouses, um, all first fill sherry seasoned, and brought them together to give you one of the, the darkest, um, most brooding looking Macallans that we've had in a while. The second thing to look at is the body. If you swirl the whiskey in the glass, you might see it sticks to the side of the glass and you get tears or legs that form down the side. This gives you an idea of the body. Some would say the alcohol content of the whiskey as well, but the Macallan is always viscous. We've got really small stills. We create a big, thick mouth coating spirit. But let's face it, you don't just want to look at it. You want to experience the aroma. So have a sniff if you haven't done so already. Hopefully you'll see some nice, rich, dry fruits. It is, for someone who works in the, the cask master of Eagle for the distillery, I'm very proud to say it's very much an oak-driven whiskey, so we're showcasing the quality of the casks that we're buying at Macallan. All first fill sherry seasoned, so nice and rich. Bold, but it has a sophistication. There's top notes in this whiskey um, that you, just, you don't see in, in, in other single malts. Fourth thing we look for is the palate, the taste. So, cheers, everyone. Cheers. Take a small sip, swirl it around your mouth, let it coat the palate, and you'll see that oak is the first thing that you taste, and then it, and then it sort of um, disappears into complexity. You get these real sophisticated. Um, kind of charred pineapple, tropical aroma, the flavours coming through, and then the oak shows its face at the end as well. It takes you on a journey. 
Oak and, um, and leather aromas were two of the things that Kirsty wanted to capture with this whisky, particularly because she spent some time at the Bentley factory in Crewe. Um, and the, the areas where they were looking at the sustainably sourced leather and also the, uh, the wood veneers um, actually transported her back to her father's um, cabinet making workshop in the very north of Scotland. So the inspiration for the flavour of this, this whisky is from her time that she spent with the, the Bentley team. The fifth and the final thing we look for in any whisky is the finish. How long does it sit on the palate? Does it make your mouth dry out? Does it make you salivate? Most importantly, does it make you want to go back for another sip? And I think judging by the expressions around the room, the answer is either yes or I've finished it. Can I get a little bit more? <laughs> <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, we are very proud to, to present the Macallan Horizon. Come up, have a look at this wonderful piece of engineering. If you have any questions about the Macallan or the whiskey this evening, I'm around all evening, um, as well as the, the rest of the team. Thank you very much. Slanji Bar, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you.